Okay, here they are, new for 2024, the Vera Ratcheting Bit Drivers. 838RAS and the 838RARM. I got mine from KC Tool, and my mystery sticker was very appropriate. Thank you, KC Tool. They are both manufactured in the Czech Republic. They both have the same 10 degree ratchet in them. But as you can see, they are not the same size. As of today, you cannot get this size with this chuck, and you cannot get this size with the wrap adapter. If you were thinking that this is the same size as the 813, you can see that it is a step up in size from the 813 handle. It is the same handle size as the quarter inch Zyklop. And since they even put a wrap adapter on the 813, maybe someday we'll see a wrap adapter on the 838 RAS. The 838 RAM is the same handle size as the Vario, the 816, and the 3 8 Zyklop. You have any of these, that's the handle size of the 838 RARM. And that handle size is slightly smaller than their standard screwdriver handle size. And I am very excited to report that they did the ratchet selector right. You flip it in the direction that you want to drive the fastener and that's the direction that the ratchet goes. I love it. There is a center lockout. This is the play when it's locked out in both directions. There is a little bit of added wobble in the ratchet. But the fact that this ratchet is so easy to actuate and intuitive I can forgive the play in it. So many ratchets on many different brands do not do this. Typically, it's opposite. This is the play with the small one locked out side to side. It has less bit wobble than the wrap adapter version. Retention is done only with the magnets. There's no detents. So this is a Weha insert bit. You can see how that fits in there. It's not very deep. Okay. Here's a PB Swiss C6 bit. You can see how that fits in there. The shallow depth of the bit holder is not unusual. It's the same as the PB Swiss, which is also the same on this one. The 813 is actually a little bit deeper than the 838. So if you were wondering if this would fit in your bit check, no, it won't. This is the wobble on an E6. It really isn't too bad. If you're just putting in one of these short C6 bits, I don't think that bit wobble is gonna bother anybody. Gotta put some Japanese bits in there, see what it's like. Let's look at the 838RM, Japanese bit. Here's an insert bit. PB Swiss. Here's an E6. I think the wobble is mostly down here. I, I really don't think the wobble is here. I think the wobble is happening down here, you know. If you're using shorter bits in it, it totally makes sense. Okay. This Annex ratcheting screwdriver has very low back drag. This one has less. If this one had more back drag than this one, this is the ratchet we would be hearing. So this one has less back drag than this one. 
And of course, nothing beats a roll gear for back drag, but the roll gear isn't as easy to actuate. Okay, here's the Zyklop quarter inch ratchet, and it has much less back drag than the Zyklop quarter inch ratchet. So there we have it, low back drag, good ratchet actuation design. There's a little bit of bit wobble in the bit holders, but that's getting nitpicky. I am super happy with these. There will be affiliate links in the description below. Any use of my affiliate links is greatly appreciated. Thank you for watching.